Hey guys! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> guys, we're in the house. We already started bringing some stuff in here. Let me show you guys over here. These are some plates we just got. That is a rug that we got from at home, I think. And we have a small full length mirror here. This is what my outfit looks like. It's just a casual moving day outfit, I guess. <laughs> And then over here, we have a brand new mirror that I just got from at home. This is going to go up somewhere. We haven't decided yet. So we just have some stuff all over the place here. And we're just starting to move some stuff in. What you is that? You have to buy paint. What a fool. Is that a white? A perfect white. Yes, that's for cabinets and stuff. So here's the thing. As I told you guys, the kitchen over here, the kitchen does not have an island. So we're going to be placing an island here. And we're going to use that paint to paint the island. And it says it's the perfect white. Yep. So is it for wood? Yeah. You see that oh yeah, it's for wood. So right there. So you can use it for walls and you can also use it for wood. So we already have the island here. This is the base of the island. This is what we're gonna be painting white. They're gonna install the countertop over here. And then we're gonna paint this part so that it can match the rest of the stuff in here. I love this marble. At first I was kind of bothered by the fact that it's not the same white because this is darker and this is white, but this blends in perfectly fine because of the backsplash. As you can see, there are some whites in the backsplash. And then also these little parts of the windows, they all have the same marble. So it kind of fits in with everything. And the fact that the cabinets are white, it's gonna blend in with the countertop here. So yeah, where'd you go? So we have a lot of stuff to do. We have our dining table here. Voila. We, have, we have this guy over here. Oh, my water. This will be in a video. <laughs> so, oh, I forgot to show you guys this. We have another mirror here as well. Nothing is really in place yet. Let me show you guys. This is a full length mirror. You guys know that I love, love, love mirror. This is a really big one. I got this one from at home a while back. I'm gonna shoot a lot of my vlogs on my phone just because we're so busy, we're moving around and I don't have time to carry my camera around. So I'm gonna be using my phone for a lot of my vlogs. So yeah, this is what this mirror looks like. I'm either gonna hang it on the wall or just find a nice space to put this. But we have our old dining table here. It has a lot of mess on it. That is my coffee. I have my computer there for when I edit later. We have some stuff here. And we just have a lot going on here, so. But I'm gonna show you guys much more detail later. So guys, we're gonna go to the Family Dollar. We're gonna go pick out some brush. Is it a brush? Mm -hmm. Paint brush? Paintbrush. So we're gonna go to Family Dollar. We're gonna go pick out some paint brush. And we're gonna try to see if we can paint this white. I'm gonna grab my bag, grab my coffee, and we're out of here. Oh wait, I can't take my house slippers. Where are my shoes? Where's my winter boot? Oh, here it is. No, that's house slippers. Let's go. Do I have my phone? Wow. The weather is really nice, y'all. I forgot to tell you guys, we have the moving truck here. That is what we're using. Are we taking the moving truck? That is the garage from the outside, y'all. I know I haven't showed you guys the inside yet, but that is it from the outside. Oh my God, it's so breezy. So. So we are here at Michael's. We're gonna go see if they have paintbrushes. I don't know, I've never bought paintbrushes from there, but we'll see. That's Michael's right there. It's not that cold, so I don't really need my coat, but I'm always cold, so. Yeah, it's nice outside today. Let's go down this way. Oh, they have a lot of stuff here. Like store stuff. Lots of flowers and this is what they have but i don't think these are for actual painting i think these are for like artwork and stuff so we're gonna end up going to walmart or family dollar or something but yeah this is their entire painting aisle but i think it's just for artwork 
So Michael's did not have the paintbrush we want, so we're gonna go check out the Dollar Tree. Maybe in the back. I doubt they have it. Yep. Yep, this might be fine. This is what we need. And then we need some of these brush. Is that a brush? Mm -hmm. So how much is the kit? Let's get one of these. Yeah. Or even one of these. Okay. Too small. Right. Get this. You yeah, can put it away. Yeah. This? Mm -hmm. And this? Okay, so this is the one we're gonna get. Yep, that should work. And then what else? Yeah, let's go to the Dollar Tree. I'm sure they have brushes there. So we are here at the Dollar Tree and I am seeing these. So this is the house color, that one right there. So I'm wondering if we should get this yeah. color or that color. What do you think? That color, the house color. This color? Yes. So let's get a few. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's four. Okay, great. There's four. So we're gonna get four of these. And um, what else? Look. Let's get a little shovel. <laughs> Gonna get a little shovel for yard work. Little rake. And what else? Let's see what else they have here. Bunny, please stop here. <laughs> These are cute. Oh, These. That's it? Yeah. It's for table, table cover. Okay. So we'll grab one Two. of those. It. Yeah, it's pretty big. Okay. We'll grab one of those. Okay. And we can get that. Okay. We good? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we are back. These are the things we got from the store. We got some cups as well, just because we're busy and we don't have time to wash dishes, but we did get some good stuff. So these are the paint brushes we got. We got these, and then we also got this. We also got this, and we got this as well. So these ones were from the Dollar Tree, and we got some tapes. We got these for the yard. And then we got this to cover up the floors so that I can paint the cabinet.
So all I'm doing is painting this. I'm going to put the first coat on and I'm going to put as many coats as needed to get it to be white, just like these ones. So that is what we're going to be working on here. I got paint on my hair. Ugh, I should have known. I forgot to put my hair up. I have to put it up right now. Oh shoot, where's the little hair tie thing? Okay, okay, it's right here. Is it gonna come off? Okay, I gotta put it up. So Nandy went to get us something to eat. So I'm just here painting the island. As you can see over there, I have that side painted. I'm gonna do that all the way around and then I'm gonna go ahead and repaint. And if it's not completely white, I'm gonna do that until we, um, you know, get the color that we desire. So family, let me tell you a little story about this kitchen island. So as I've said a few times, the kitchen did not come with an island well i really really wanted one so i started to look online we found a person that was going to come and build it for us the only thing we had to do was get the counter piece the piece that goes on top of it so i was thinking do i want marble or do i want granite they are both really great quality but marble is obviously more expensive so once we found the person, it was going to cost us a few hundred dollars, but then the countertop itself was going to cost us close to a thousand dollars. So I started to look online. I was looking on those um, Facebook marketplace type sites and there was this young couple who was renovating their entire kitchen. Well, they were going to sell the marble piece. So when I saw it, it actually matched our measurements for our kitchen. So I contacted them and the guy was like, this thing is super heavy. We've been trying to sell it, but no one would buy it because first of all, it doesn't fit in anyone's car. And secondly, we don't have enough people to take it because it's so heavy. So I told him I wanted it. So he said, okay, if you can get it out of here, I'll give it to you for a really good deal because I just need to get rid of it. Well, that was a blessing for me because he needed to get rid of it, but I really needed it. So I ended up paying much, much lower if I had it bought from a store or something. So anyways, when we went to pick up the countertop, the little marble piece, he said that he was going to throw out the bottom part, the part that you're seeing me paint right now. He said he was going to throw it away because he didn't have any use for it. So I asked him if I could have it and he said, sure. So that also saved us a lot of money because all we had to do was paint it to match the rest of our stuff. And that is exactly how we got here. Okay, guys, so I am done with the painting, as you can see there. Now it's starting to look like everything else. So that is what it looks like. Now all we have to do is install it. So I'm just gonna set it there and let it dry. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna place some adhesive. We're gonna use that, place it on top of the counter. That thing is pretty heavy, y'all. That is over 200 pounds. But just because we have a child and I feel like it'll make me feel better as well. So we're just gonna play it safe and have it actually installed. But from my understanding is they're gonna place the 
adhesive and then place the countertop on top of it and then it's going to be done so that is basically what we have so far i absolutely love it i'm happy that i was able to do it myself because then that saved me a lot of money what a lot of people don't understand is that apartment furniture is not the same as home furniture because your home is much bigger it's much more i don't know sophisticated apartments you can have some nice stuff but it's usually smaller things but anyways like i said i've done my part and it's just up to everybody else to do their part i'm waiting for nandy now he went with his friends him and his friends are actually um pulling stuff from the house i think they actually just got here the truck is right there so i think they're here so i think i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here i'm super hungry my voice is tired. I'm just going to take a break and I'm going to end this vlog here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait to show you guys all the update. They're going to install it tonight. So by the time I put up a new vlog, you're going to be able to see what it looks like. So guys, this is what the new kitchen looks like. It is absolutely beautiful i am so in love with this kitchen i can't even begin to tell you guys how happy i am but we are here for the island so let me tell you guys all about that so as you can see that is the island that's the one i was working on like i said i painted it i did a few coats and as you can see it matches the rest of the white so this granite countertop let me come close so you guys can see i just wanted to give you guys a view from a distance but this is what the countertop looks like so this is actually marble i keep calling it granite but it's actually marble it is white a little bit of dark gray and some light grays the rest of the counter is granite and it's also a dark gray and you might say why did you go for a lighter color in the middle the reason for that is the kitchen is not super huge and because i already have those darker countertops i wanted the island to almost not be there but be there if that makes sense so the lighter the color furniture the bigger the space looks so that is why i went for this white marble and i also painted the island white one reason is because i wanted it to blend in with everything else of course and the second reason like i said is because the white gives the illusion of a bigger space so that is what the counter looks like. I'm gonna show you the other side of this. So this counter, you can actually plug some stuff here and use on the countertop. So this side is clearly where the bar stools are gonna go. So let me show you the other side of the counter. So okay, looking from this side, this is what the island looks like. It has the design on this side. I wish I can turn it to the other side because that's where the living room and dining room is, but it's actually meant to be turned this way because those drawers right there is where you're gonna store your stuff, like your pots, your pan, and everything. So it's actually meant to be facing this way. But anyways, this is what it looks like from this side. And then as you can see, I still have some tape on it. I'm gonna take those out when the paint is complete completely dry but I just wanted to leave that there for now just because I didn't want to mess with the metal I forgot to show you guys this but right now the metals like the handles right there are supposed to be gold I'm thinking of changing it I love 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 crystal so I'm thinking of changing it but yeah this is basically what the island looks like I am completely in love with it so yeah that's basically it thank you guys again so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one bye